Now, have you ever heard of the Mad Monk of San, a chilling urban legend from the heart of Wales? This tale originates from the peaceful village of San, a place steeped in history and mystery. Nestled amongst rolling hills and ancient landmarks, San holds a secret that sends shivers down the spines of its inhabitants. The story goes back centuries to the time when a monastery stood tall in the village. Among its inhabitants was a monk who, as stories tell, fell into the depths of madness following a tragic love affair. Consumed by heartbreak and despair, he turned into a figure of fear forever etched in the village's folklore. On foggy nights, when the moon is just a dull glow behind a veil of clouds, the villagers say you can still feel his presence, unseen yet palpable. A cold breeze that sends a shiver down your spine, a fleeting shadow in the corner of your eye, an eerie noise that echoes through the stillness of the night. These are the signs of the mad monk's haunting. Tales of his sightings have been passed down through generations, each account more chilling than the last. He's said to cause strange occurrences, like lights flickering without reason, doors creaking open on their own, and an unnerving feeling of being watched. Just a tale spun by the locals, or a ghostly figure doomed to roam the earth for eternity, the decision is yours. Now from the haunted village of San, we journey to the ancient Scare House, a place steeped in mystery and ghostly tales. Skur House, an imposing mansion with a past as dark as its stone walls, is more than just a historic landmark. It's a symbol of a tragic love story that transcends time, one that has birthed one of Wales' most chilling urban legends. The tale revolves around a young woman named Elizabeth, whose life was as tragic as her death was heartrending. Elizabeth was the only daughter of a cruel and heartless father who cared more for his wealth than his own flesh and blood. The mansion became her prison as her father sought to control her life, denying her the freedom to love and to live. It's said that Elizabeth fell in love with a shipwrecked sailor, a man her father deemed unworthy of his daughter's hand. In his rage, he confined Elizabeth within the cold and lonely walls of Skur House, where she was left to wither away from the world. It's believed that Elizabeth died of heartbreak, her spirit unable to find rest. Even today, visitors report ghostly apparitions, believed to be Elizabeth herself. Other times, it's eerie sounds that echo through the mansion at night, chilling cries that seem to reverberate from a time long past. Some speak of a chilling sensation, a sense of being watched by unseen eyes, as if Elizabeth's spirit is still trapped within the mansion, longing for her lost love. But is this the true tale of Skur House, or merely a story spun by locals fueled by the whispers of the wind? Could it be that Elizabeth's spirit is indeed haunting the mansion, forever trapped by her father's cruelty? Or is this just another urban legend, a tale brought to life by the power of suggestion and our fascination with the supernatural? Is Elizabeth still trapped within the walls of Skur House, longing for her lost love? Or is this uh, another urban legend brought to life by the whispers of the locals? Only the brave dare to find out. Urban legends or historical hauntings, the tales of the Mad Monk and the ghost of Skur House continue to chill the bones of those who hear them. These stories, eerie and shrouded in mystery, have survived the passage of time, preserved through the power of local folklore. They create an atmosphere of suspense and intrigue, a chilling reminder of the past that lingers in the present. Whether you believe or not, there's no denying the power of a good story. Sleep tight, and remember, the next time you're in Wales, keep an eye out for the mad monk and the ghostly girl of Skurhouse.